Look, there is a big difference between what Israel is now facing from seven different fronts than what is going on in the Balkans. Because in our case, there is one orchestrator of all of these arenas, and that is Iran. Iran is the country which funds Hezbollah. Iran is the country that funds Hamas and Islamic Jihad. Iran is the country that enters money to the West Bank in order to recruit more people. Iran is the one who's working together with the Houthis to attack Israel and also with the pro-Iranian -Iraq Iraqi militias to attack Israel. So this is really a magnitude of a country which is investing billions of dollars to buy weapons, to improve the weapons. And we are seeing also in the war with Ukraine their impact as well by selling advanced drones uh, to Russia so they could use it against uh, the Ukrainian people. So uh, there, there is quite uh, a difference, I would say. As for the issue of NATO, I do see a similarity between Israel and Serbia. Israel is not a NATO member, and Serbia is not a NATO member. But we are both partners of NATO which means there is cooperation to a certain level, which means that NATO regards both Serbia and Israel as countries that have to contribute to their needs. So this is a similarity which I'm finding between our two countries. We are Jews and uh, as Jews we have been prosecuted all along the history in many countries in the world. And we know how important it is to be able to feel free, to um, practice your religion, uh, to um, study books in your own language. And so this is something we, we will support 100%.